This video covers how to search specific elements within Aviva E3D 2.1. The search utility is located in the search group of the Home tab. Clicking the search button will open the search form which is docked on the right panel. A string may be entered in the Name Contains text box to search for specific element names. An element type must be specified. Multiple types may also be entered in the Element Type text box. The text box below indicates the scope of the search. By default, the current element is selected and the search will be performed on all elements below the CE. Other scope options allow to specify the name of the scope element or the current collection. More search tools are available in the form for advanced searches. The Attribute Filter section allows to refine the search with criteria for specified attributes. The Free Filter selection allows to enter a PML expression for more advanced filters. The Search Scope section allows to specify a database of volume or a modification time as the scope of the search. The Manage Searches section allows to save and restore previous searches. To run the search with the current settings, click the Search button. This will open the Collections form, which displays the search results in a grid. This video covers the use of search tools within Aviva E3D 2.1. When performing a search, click the More Search Tools link label to expand the Advanced Search sections. In the Attribute Filter section, click the Add Filter link label. A list of attributes will appear in the Attribute column for the selected element type. Select the desired attribute or enter its name in the field. In the next column, select an operator, for example, greater than. In the next column, enter the criteria value to use with the selected operator. In this example, the search will return all the valves with a bore greater than 100mm in tra.site. To visualise the results, select all the elements in the collection grid. Then select 3D View Highlight from the contextual menu. It is possible to add or remove filters in the list. Note that the filters here are linked with the logical AND. It is possible to create more advanced filters in the free filter section using PML expressions. Here, the expression will filter the valves with a vertical direction. In the Search Scope section, it is possible to refine the search within a given volume. The volume may be specified explicitly with coordinates or using the spatial occupancy of an element. In this example, the element Pump 1 is used to define the search volume. Two options allow to select the elements that are wholly or partially within the volume. In the Manage Searches section, it is possible to save and restore searches. Clicking the link label will display a form to save the current searches with a specific name and location.
In the Location options, select Global Settings to save the search in public documents. Or select Local Settings for the Windows user's local application data. Or select Project Settings to save the search in the current project and share it with other users. Or select Roaming Settings for the Windows user's roaming application data. The saved searches will then appear in the selection list for the selected location. This exercise covers how to search for a utility within Aviva E3D 2.1. Open the search form. Enter Bran in the element type text box. Select the element option and enter Site Piping Area 01. Run the search. Create an attribute filter for H bore greater than 50 millimeters. Save the search as Bran with H bore greater than 50 millimeters.